All right, guys, here we go. We're going to take something with great hands for a lifetime. We're going to put it on the drum set. Bum, bum, bum. Number seven from page 20. Number seven, right there. Four bar exercise. Number seven. From Great Hands for a Lifetime. If you don't yet have it, HudsonMusic.com right now. Digital download. Zap right to your mobile device, your whatever device you want. They have every device you can think of. Okay? So you're going to do that. You're going to get it. You're going to look at number seven. All right? Number seven is a very simple accent exercise, and it goes something like this. One, two, three, four. the accent exercise. The assignment for the Igo Challenge. Boom. Drum set. We're going to play zone defense. I might bring this up later in the challenge, but zone defense is the right hand plays this zone, the left hand stays in this zone. So left hand does not go over here, right hand does not go over here. It's zone defense. If you know how to play basketball, you already know what I'm talking about. Zone. Right here. Zone. So you stay in your zone. All right. Now, we're going to take that exercise and we're going to put it on the drums. All right? Slowly. The point of this exercise on the drums is that the accents are on the toms, the taps are on the snare, and you get great, ah, perfect sound quality. Now, the other thing I'm going to make sure that you know is that I am using absolutely nothing fancy. I'm not using a, an external mic. I'm not using anything on my drums. You can do this too. I'm not making a record here, and I'm not looking to blow your mind. You can do this too, because it's going to sound good, because I'm playing it well. It will sound good even through an external, uh, you know, just a, the internal microphones on an iPhone. So you don't need to do anything fancy to get on this challenge, tag yourself, and post, okay? Let's get thousands of people posting this exercise and see how people do. Do not be ashamed if you do not have a lot of tech in your studio. Do it proud, all right? If you play it well, if you have your drum, drums tuned well, it's going to sound great, okay? Let it, let it all hang out. Do not be ashamed, all right? Here we go. This is what the exercise sound like slow on the drum set. One, two, and three, and four. And Right hand lead, left hand lead. So right hand lead will sound like this. One, two, three, four. Challenging thing starts to come in about getting great sound quality hitting in the center of the drums. Okay? So you don't want this. You know what I mean? Rim central. Okay? So you want to try to get in the center as much as you possibly can. Sit up, core tight, axis, axis, minimize your motions, soft hands, fluid. A little bit brighter. One, two, three, four. Okay? So let's get a little workout in there. 
nice and bad. All right? Challenge yourself with the tempos up. All right? Single sticking. tempos kick your own butt on this because it's not it's not that easy actually to get that happening you don't want that sounds like it's, it's like hitting a bunch of stuff discipline okay two sound surfaces two sound sources perfect quality good luck